Yeah, that's right. Morgan, Morgan, Freeman, and mm, story time. Damn it, Morgan, Morgan. Hey, excuse me, story time. Once upon a time in the future, on the planet Mars, three Earthmen found something they didn't expect: a giant ball of crack cocaine. It would change humanity forever. With ten lifetimes of cocaine for everyone on the planet, lifespans were shortened by two thirds. Everyone was higher than a Domino's pizza dishwasher all day long. Society fell to pieces in a week. The few who survived just had more coke for themselves, the way they looked at it. But what they didn't realize is that the owner of this humongous ball of baby tea, a race of alien baseheads called the Fallen. Wanted their baby back, and weren't no cabbage head flunky tweakers gonna stand in their way. Many years later, Peter Dinklage, the guy who plays Tyrion Lannister on Game of Thrones, he finally found the only person who could stop the fallen. It was a woman so strong that she ingested enough crack cocaine to kill a whale and Keith Richards. It worked. You're alive. I need some crack. They called her Defender of the Flakes protector of the P-Funk, the guardian of the G-Rock, depending on who you talk to. But her real name was Sweet Hand Sally, palms so smooth it's like you're making love to cotton candy. She had to find Rixus, the devil archon, and send a message to the Fallen. And because he owed her money, Sally headed over to the darkness zone where Rixus and his cronies hung out. Rixus sent a bunch of vandals, dregs, skanks at her, but she wasn't having any of it. Then they found him. It's in the walls! I want my money, bitch! Sally decided to give Rixus something to think about. You just killed an Archon. The Guardian always pays her debts. Sally sent quite a message to the Fallen when she killed Rixus. Literally, she actually sent them a message via the Postmaster Robot. The message was, Go fuck yourself. Crack Planet is mine. And that's how Sweet Hand Sally fulfilled her destiny and got her crack rock, baby. TFP. For other videos like this one here, check out Game Society Pimps. And for professional voiceovers and impersonations, go to jasonsvoices.com.